Hey, what's going on guys? x this here and welcome back to another video. Today, we're doing Mist of Tyranna Scythe. We're doing my plus 12 key. I decided, you know what, may as well record it because I haven't really posted too much like PvE content on the channel and I haven't really posted any, you know, high keys in general. So I thought, you know what, may as well um, go my Warlock, do um, a key and just see how it goes really this is just a pug group um my key so we're doing plus 12 tyranna scythe the affixes are as fellows it's fortified so non-boss enemies are quite hard nearly died there we got spiteful um so a fiends rise up from the ground just basically going to random players we also got grievous um so basically you just need to have some sustainability here a little bit and then we also got prideful so pretty decent obviously the more percent you kill um a prideful will obviously spawn so pretty decent there our talents are here this is the build that we're going to be playing it's like my go-to pve spec like pve build sorry and then we've gone with sacralasis dark slippers as our legendary um along with necrolord as a covenant with mni so it's very very good focus malinancy shade of terror uh, Resolute Barrier and Rolling Agony as our conduit, so we're getting there slowly. Definitely going good. I was going to play Demo, potentially. Like, I was thinking about it, because um, I wanted to try out Demo and see how it feels, because you, I've seen, like, a clip where Demo can actually potentially one-shot with um, Demon Bolt, and I feel like you could get it off quite nicely, but I decided not to. May as well just stick to um, what I play the most which is affliction but I definitely do want to try out demo in both PvP and PvE so it'd be a very very good all right can we skip this nice we can indeed good job all right warlock pet no we're not We're good. I was I was wondering like, what do you mean? But he, he was just wondering if my pet pulled, but we didn't. So we're good. Nice. All right. We don't really have anything to talk about today. Like, I'm not sure what the topics are gonna be. So if you enjoy PVE content, then obviously this video is for you. But we're just gonna be going through it smoothly. Hopefully, hopefully we can obviously do it in time as well. That's the main goal today. Pushing our Raider.io score potentially, and see how it goes, man. We want um, some good rewards from our Great Vault. Alright, come on. Alright, big damage now. There we go. Malfic Rapture. It does so much damage. I need to utilise my Drain Life a little bit more though. Especially with my Haunt too. There we go. Dot these up. Slow them down. Nice, good job. Alright, close this window. Awesome, but hopefully everyone's having a really nice day. Fingers crossed, you know, you've been enjoying World of Warcraft and everything in general. And, man, I'm just really enjoying playing WoW and playing my Warlock and stuff. I've been, like, RBGs are so much fun. I haven't really done um, much um, in the past, like, week or so. But I need to start, obviously, pushing that again. And just in general, I need to start leveling some more characters because i really enjoy leveling too i was thinking of potentially leveling my um rogue or my mage next but i'm not sure i, I just need to gear them but it takes a little while to obviously start gearing up your ult so that's why i haven't done it too much and literally before i recorded this video i did the world boss right so i was on my road just um doing some mining and like leveling a bit right and then um did a dungeon and i was doing the world boss and only one piece dropped on six characters. Like, I swear, that's the only piece I've gotten on all my characters in, like, two or three weeks. It's actually insane. Alright, kill these shades. My damage is mediocre at the moment, but it should be good on boss fights, so don't worry about that. Alright, come on. I'm actually really happy. I'm, um, Necro, though. Necro's a lot of fun. And as demo, it's very, very good. I think my chat's bugged. There we go. Because sometimes if you close a whisper window, I've noticed this, if you close a whisper window after talking to somebody, sometimes it phases with your general chat for no apparent reason whatsoever. So it's kind of bad. Alright, I just kicked it. 
My bad. Alright. Here we go. Do we pop a potion? I guess we do. Ready? Three, two, one. Potion time. Nice. And then we decimate and bolt at low HP. Hopefully this hits. Nice. I completely messed up my rotation there. Damn, man. These guys, these guys are really high item level, by the way. The rogue's 215, I think, and the hunter is 222, and I am 213, so... Yeah. Not great, but it's okay. Kick this. Nice. Just going to put my um, weakness on both of them. Here comes Haunt. I need to start doing some Warlock Guides though. I'm definitely planning on doing that and obviously doing some more PvP videos. So, fingers crossed I can do that. I just wanted to do a PvE video today because long time since I've done one of those on the channel. Alright, Haunt. Brilliant. Decimating Bolt time. We're going to boost um, our Intellect I think, right? Nice. Yeah, boosts our intellect and everybody's primary stat, as I recall. We just read it here. Decimating bolt increases my intellect and up to... And, yeah, primary stat of four nearby players. I marked it. If you, if you mark um, that boss, by the way, you get to see where they go. So, he went through this way. Well, she went through that way and then went through the far um, left, it looks like. But you only, can, um, you only notice the first two because, obviously, they go out of range so it's actually pretty decent i learned that while i was doing like i don't know if it was a key or whether it was just leveling um one of the people marked the the boss there and they were like you can skip the first two and i was just like oh my god didn't realize wait the shades have to die before you can continue damn man nice there we go this one guys nice and then it's this one straight ahead of us it looks like but it could be the one on the right I should be playing my imp I think because there's nothing I can really kick as well like there are stuff I can kick don't get me wrong but probably better if I play imp for damage because we have a rogue as well but it's okay right I need to start using my horn because I'm just messing up this so much But it's okay. 22 minutes left. As long as I can put my corruption on everything just to slow them down, it works out. We can kite this. Nice. Good job, guys. And it should be... Ah, oh, wait. Kill this one. So it's either this one in front of us or it's the one on the right. <laughs> God damn it. Marked. There you go. No Told you, it was one of the two. I had a 50-50 chance and I failed. That's going to waste about 10 seconds of time, but... That's nah, not too much. Little trick there, but you just got to notice where the boss goes, because... It's kind of hard. You, you obviously notice where the boss goes on the first one. But other than that, I don't know. You don't notice it too much. Just got to pay a little bit of attention. Alright, here comes Horn. CC the shade, heal myself here. I'm just getting chunked down, guys. And I'm doing, like, no damage right now. Usually I'll be at like top of the meters or close to it. They just died too fast before my dots can actually do anything. Nice, and then I'm going to get a big absorption shield here. Probably should have played um, with Plague Divisor Marilef just for the um, essences, but I don't know. Which one is it? It's that one. Go. God, this tank, man. He literally said, let me do it. 
And then he's now moaning that we're not letting him. No, that we are letting him do it. I don't know. I'm going to choose a burst here. May as well because boss isn't close. Here comes Drain Soul. No point using that there. Nice. I'm going to coil. Get on this manifestation. There we go. Not going to worry about the ads here. Okay, that just went straight onto me. He apologised, real good. I probably should have noticed anyway. There we go, I'll move away from it. There we go. Decimating Bolt. Definitely hits for quite a bit, I'm not going to lie. Decimating Bolt does. Alright. Wait, so it's this one, right? Yeah, had a feeling, because that, um, that was the only one with a shield. Nice. Being li I'm being like and doing dungeons though. Like, I don't know if I prefer these dungeons over Shadowlands ones or not. No, uh, sorry, um, BFA ones because I really like the BFA raids and dungeons. There was obviously a couple I didn't like, like Shrine of the Storm, for example. Really didn't like that, and King's Rest was okay. But I don't know. There, I find that there's fewer dungeons I enjoy um, playing in Shadowlands which is good but also I really like the BFA dungeons definitely prefer um, BFA PvP nice we're here now is this the boss no nearly though see the corruption in haunt here comes the damage Then we do Malphic Rapture. Kick this. Just letting um, my Drain Soul go off on everything for my Shadow and Brace stacks. Agony's gonna fall, but it's okay. Here comes the big Malphic Rapture. I feel like I'm undergeared or something, man. Just not doing as much damage as I would have liked, but it's okay. Here comes the damage. Nice. Jeez, these shades though, man. They eat up a lot of your time because you're just constantly, um, obviously hitting them. Damn, this guy just knows where to go, apparently. Alright, I'm going to put a gateway down. And let's go. Sorry if you can hear any background noise. Drain Soul. Dark Glare. Ugh, watch out for this. Pop the potion. There we go. Insta slow. Alright, which one is it? So we got... It's this one. Because it doesn't have a shield. Make sure my dots don't fall off there. Watch out for the dodgeball. Good job. Now we got to do this a couple more times, probably. It's on me. I'm just going to fear it. Doesn't matter. It's probably going to break. That did not hit me, but okay. I swear it didn't. Alright, he's going to do... Um, the illusion in a second. Oh, she is. Oh, I like being, um, having, like, the affliction slow. It's quite nice. Which one is it? This one. It looks like. Yeah, because that's the one that's not a leaf. Alright. Alright. My damage is okay. I, I feel like it's a little bit low, though, you know? 
I don't know. Watch out. There we go, Maverick Rapture time. Into a decimating bolt now. And the bus should die in a second. Ugh. No, please tell me you don't have to do the guessing. Oh, we've got a guess again. This one, shield. Right? Yeah. Bursting it. Why not? Big damage. Nice. Brilliant. And now I'm going to absorb the boss. Like the boss's essence. More HP. My shield's going to be a lot bigger now. <laughs> the guy said clean. Really nice. My damage wasn't too bad there. We only did a couple thousand less. So definitely not complaining. And we also have um, Night Fae, obviously, so we could have, we, well, we skipped at the beginning, got the buff, and we also was able to activate that um, mechanic there, which is good. I'm going to stun everybody here. Here comes Haunt. I can dispel that. I'll purge it. Can't purge this one because it's on a cooldown. Well, it's on cooldown. Decimating Bolt time really nice i definitely want to try out the other specs so demo and destro and pve just to see what they feel like because affliction feels good but my my damage at the moment i don't know like on trash it feels like they die like the ads die too fast especially if you have melee on your team because the melee just cleave them down like really really quickly so i don't know what i should be doing in terms of that but so far it feels good Especially on boss fights, it's really nice. Alright, there we go. Haven't been up to much though. Literally, like I said, just been... Um, I would like today, for example, been doing my world boss. Well, bosses. Um, as you see this video, it's probably... Uh, well, I'm recording this on... Um, what's it? Thursday. I forgot the day for a second. Recording this on Thursday, so you'll probably see it either Friday or Saturday. And, man, just haven't been up to much today. Obviously got a video out, which was my Walking Dead video. And other than that, just been doing a couple of world bosses. Well, doing all the world bosses, all the world boss on my characters. And just been leveling, that's about it. And I do need to start gearing and doing RBGs, though. I think... I should be doing that just so I can push rating because my rating is low in RBGs right now and obviously I need it to be higher to upgrade my PvP gear so I want to do that plus I really really want to craft the Leaper Legendary in my Warrior just to obviously test it out in Battlegrounds because I feel like that would be amazing and be like a designated um, flag kappa or something like flag carrier that would be awesome. So I might make it like a 190 version of the Leaper Legendary on my Warrior. And then I need that Templar's Verdict, the final Verdict Legendary on my Paladin. Because that's the one I was initially thinking about crafting. But then I didn't. So we shall obviously see. But I need to also work on a Destro Legendary. Just so I can have a Legendary for all three specs. And yeah man, gotta get some guides out. Um, I want to do the starting zone. Um... Uh, for Exile's Reach, I want to try that out just to see what that's like. Obviously, I have every class above level 50, which is good, but I really, really want to obviously try that out to see how it is and just to get the transmog and stuff as well. Nice. More coil. We have 10 minutes left. Absolutely smashing time right now. I need to go for Keystone Master. That was one of my goals and potentially Gladiator. But, like, I literally haven't do done any arena. Like, I haven't done any arena at all since Shadowlands. Like, I've done some skirmishes, but no rated arena. And I actually don't know why I haven't. I just, like, because with the Great Vault Rewards, because I have so many characters, I guess, could be part of it. And part of my thinking is i got to do my keys because that's, like, the easiest way to get... Um, your reward done oh sorry that's your easiest way to get your reward done for the week 
and just makes sense on my alts. But I don't know. Not like the RGB, well, RBG, sorry, cap is bad, or just the PvP cap in general is bad, and not, and the raid ones ain't bad either, so. Should be doing that. My damage is terrible right now, though. This tank's doing so much damage, but once we get onto the boss, should be good. Nice. I really wanted to do this dungeon as well, because I usually I would, you know, if the key's like below like level 12 or something, right, I will just um, find a group and do like a 13 or a 12 or something. And I was like, oh, I've only done like a plus two. Like, I think my highest for this one's a plus two. Oh no, my highest is a plus eight for this one, but it was over time. So this is going to actually boost my IO up a little bit. Don't really like mind my IO or anything, right? I never push it. But I just figured it's quite fun to get it up. See that bug again, man. The chat. The chat keeps coming up. Alright, let's go. I wonder if there's any good rewards in this dungeon for me. Nah, that's crit. Some haste gear, which is good, but obviously I won't get any pieces that are better than mine. Blizzard man, please, could you sort that bug out? When I try and close the whisper window, it just doesn't close. You have to do slash reload for it to close. Or sometimes it'll close. Good job. I wonder what key I'm going to get after as well. Oh no, dude. Okay, nice. We got past it. The reason why I'm playing Mortal Coil instead of Howl, like usually I'll play Howl for, for, for PvP. Um, but obviously this is PvE. Um, so I just play Coil, just because obviously it's Grievous as well, and I normally play that um, with my PvE spec, just because it gives me a load of healing. That guy ran directly on me, man. Nice. Kick this. Decimating Bolt. Increases everyone's primary stat. Nice. Mavic Rapture. I always play M9 in PvE, but I need to experiment with all the others. I'm yet to play Bonesmith Hermi or whatever his name is. Yeah, I'm yet to play him. Let me try that out and see how it is. We have one minute, man. Four plus two. Doesn't look like we're going to get it, unfortunately. Here comes Haunt. There we go. Alfred Rapture. Definitely going great, though. Hope I can get... What key do I want? I don't really mind. I guess the best key for me would be Spires of Ascension. And if I get Spires of Ascension, I will probably do it. So, I definitely need to because I think that's my other lowest. Yeah, that's my other lowest one. Alright, this guy said let him kick. Ready for this? Pop a potion. Big damage now. I kick that. Someone kick consumption, please. Damn! This The tank just ran away from the boss during consumption and used his um, convoke. And I think he's playing... Um, I'll check in a second. I think he's playing uh, Balance Affinity or whatever it's called. Just so he could get the Star Surges off. Now that is actually 200 IQ. What the hell? Let's see. Uh, yeah, he's playing Balance Affinity. What a legend, dude. Big Decimating Bolt damage. It actually hits for a ton as demo, but if the boss is low HP, really good too. Good job, guys. Nice. We managed to actually time that, so that's really good. That's my best dungeon done now, which is great. Did we get anything? Nothing. What key did I get, though? Trinket, please. Let's see. Does this guy get his trinket? Congratulations. Nope. You played yourself.
Spires. Oh my god. We actually got spires. Wow. That's actually incredible. I really wanted to do spires. So I'm definitely going to be doing that, guys. And if you want to see that, obviously, make sure to leave a like on this video and comment down below. Let me know if you want to see that because I'm definitely... I don't know. I definitely want to kind of push my IO score. And that's the dungeon that I've only done a two in. So it kind of makes sense. But guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then obviously make sure to leave a like. Comment down below. Like I said, if you want to um, let me know if you want to see that video. And yeah, guys, I've been Xrathus. I'll catch you in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel too. All right, see you in the next one. So, peace!